How's it going YouTube? Once again, it's Root Junkie here, and today we're going to be talking about ad-supported phones that Amazon puts out, like the Motorola Moto G 5th Gen and 4th Gen, along with the Blue R1 HD and some other tablets. What I'm going to show you today is I'm going to show you a new tool that I went ahead and put out that gets rid of these pesky, annoying ads on your lock screen on your different phones. So this tool is super simple, basically a one-click, and it'll remove these ads for you. Hope you guys like the video. Let's go do this. All right, guys, so let's get into this process. First things first, this is my device right here. This is a Moto uh, G 5th Gen. I'm just going to show it to you. Go in here into About Phone. You can see that we are on the Amazon variant. We're on Android 7.1. Uh, this is probably an older build than what's current, but it should work on new builds as well. So you can see what we're dealing with. While we're in here, let's go ahead and tap on our build number and turn on Developer Options. And you're going to have to do this on any device that you're on. So just make sure you know how to do it. Go into Developer Options and come down here where it says USB Debugging. Check it to allow USB Debugging. All right, that's basically all you need to do on your phone to get rid of these nasty ads. So we'll just show you. See, there they are. See, they keep coming back. Super annoying, right? So we're going we're gonna to alleviate that problem right here. So once you've done that, you're going to go ahead and plug in your USB cable. And like I said, this should work on Moto G 5th Gen, 4th Gen, probably even the Amazon tab tablets. If this comes up at this point, go ahead and hit Always Allow, hit OK. If it does not, you'll see it at a later point. So just make sure you pay attention to your phone while you're running this tool. Let's go over to my computer and let's do this. So guys, here we are. This is my site, rootjunkiesdl.com. Um, and we're just going to come down here to Moto G 5th Gen. And right here is the Amazon ad removal tool. And you just click on that and it's going to go ahead and download right here. I've already downloaded mine. Well, I've created it too. So right here is um, the tool. And once you extract it, I use 7-zip normally, something like this to extract it. Then you're left with this. And basically it's very simple. So we're just going to run the script. And it just shows you rejunkie.com is my site. If you haven't allowed ADB on the device, you'll see this. If you haven't, um, check your phone screen. If something should be popping up. And then, again, just talks about doing ADB debugging. So not a big deal. Um, we're just going to go ahead and hit continue and remove these lock screen ads. So right now, it's just waiting for the device to connect up and make sure that everything is functioning correctly. And that's it. Successful. Press any key, and it's going to go ahead and reboot the device. We are done on the computer. Let's just check out these ads and the fact that they are gone. So guys, that is it. This is a really sweet little method. We're just waiting for the Moto G 5th Gen to reboot. And uh, this was actually found on Reddit. A guy linked me this, and so that's why I'm sharing it with you. I just went ahead and put it into a utility. So it's nice. Here we go. This should be it. And at this point, you're done with your plug-in here. Now, this is interesting. If you have this problem, like I just did, where the ads are still there, I put a note in here, and we're going to run the tool one last time just to show you that it should go ahead and remove them. Sometimes it takes two runs. All right, so here's take two on the tool. There is a note in here that does explain that sometimes it takes uh, uh, two runs of the tool, maybe three even, to fully get them removed. So we're just going to go ahead and do that right now. So press any key to continue. Again, we're just going to go ahead and remove those uh, pesky ads on the lock screen and then hit any key. And we should reboot. And that's it on the computer. And let's check out this phone. Not sure why it requires two reboots or two um, removals. It's, I think it's almost like there's a redundant application installed and when you delete the one, you have to delete the second one. That's something that Amazon likes to do. So just by doing it twice, we've uh, fixed that redundancy and those ads should be gone off the phone. Hello, now I went ahead and I have tested this on the Moto G 4th Gen. Um, it's on Android 6.0. I've also tested on this 7.0. Mm -hmm. All right, that looks better. There you go. So if you need to run the script twice like I did, then you'll understand and you should have it. So now we can go ahead and cycle power on, off, on, off. And as you can see, the lock screen ads and actually all the Amazon ads are 
gone off of this Amazon variant of the Moto G 5th Gen. Hope you guys have liked this video. Stay tuned for more coverage um, on these Amazon devices. As you know on my channel, I like to cover them, the tablets and these Moto phones specifically, Blue, R1 HD, all this kind of stuff. It's pretty fun. We'll catch you guys in the next video. Root Junkie out.